Hello everybody. Welcome back to the regular updates from Sterling International Consulting Free Zone Enterprise, the largest ISO consulting company in the Middle East. We hope you are regularly benefiting from our updates on YouTube covering various ISO standards like ISO 9001, ISO 14001, OSHA 18001, ISO 27001, ISO 17025, ISO 22000 and rest of the ISO standards. Now in this edition of YouTube update, we are going to cover a very important topic. The topic is how can an organization get the best of the benefits from ISO 9001 implementation. We have seen almost every enterprise in the world, be it government, private, semi-government, small, big, large, multinational, they all are striving for ISO 9001 certification at least. Some companies are already certified, some companies are in the process of getting certification. Now a fundamental question arises, how can my organization get benefits from ISO implementation? Is it going to become just a certification activity? End of it, we get a certificate and we get business benefit in terms of marketing or branding or is this activity aimed at creating a corporate culture that is striving towards enhancement of quality in every process. If your objective is making the ISO certification process, helping you achieve your quality goals, aligning it with your corporate goals and objectives, you must ask this fundamental question to yourself. How my implementation process should work? How should I address all the requirements of ISO 9001 standard so that my company gets the actual and real benefit of ISO 9001 certification. There are several fantastic tools that ISO 9001 standard has given you. It all depends on how effectively, how efficiently do you use, you use those tools. And to a certain extent, it also depends on the consultant who is working with you. We as Luxury Management Consultant Private Limited and Sterling International Consulting Free Zone Enterprise in Middle East, we help our clients to realize the true benefit of ISO certification and ISO implementation. What do we do? How are we different? How do we make sure that our clients do not earn just a certificate, but they develop a fully grown up, fully matured and result oriented management system. If you want to get the best benefit out of ISO system, you need to make sure that the quality policy and quality objective alignment is done with lot of work. What is quality objective? Quality objectives are your short term and measurable goals that you set for your different processes. Now lot of amount of work, thinking and resource allocation should go in the way an organization identifies quality objectives. Because quality objectives are not just mere targets that you set, but it is linked with your key performance indicators, it is linked with your business goals, it is linked with your departmental objectives and it is linked with overall growth of the organization. So you need to make sure that you have a strategic input, strategic way is given to the quality objective identification. Now when you decide quality objectives, technically you should have a set of quality objectives for your organization as co at corporate level. You need to have departmental objectives or process wise objective which are measurable and time bound. So organizations who give lot of importance to quality objective identification, planning and tracking realize the benefit because with quality objective identification at process level, what you are doing? You are driving the entire ISO 9001 certification implementation process from top management to the root of the organization. This is what we need until unless the organization cannot implement the ISO 9001 system to the root level. 
people do not work for the iso 9001 system they are not part of the implementation they do not align themselves with the iso 9001 standard they do not feel they are a part and stakeholder in the iso process they will not get benefit now the best way to include everybody in the iso implementation process make everybody feel part of the process is to make sure that you have quality objectives defined to the root level process this will make everybody part of iso everybody make everybody we everybody would be feeling that they are part of the process and they own the process very important another fantastic tool what iso 9001 standard has got and which is normally missed, missed by lot of organization including based of the companies and sometimes lot of auditors as well is effectiveness evaluation of the process many of you would be knowing that ISO 9001 certification is a process based approach that means you identify different processes in your organization identify what is process input process output procedure in terms of how the process will get executed and the thing that is very important from ISO perspective the overall effectiveness perspective which is normally missed by people is how do I evaluate effectiveness of this process because ultimately as I mentioned starting in the starting what is the purpose of doing ISO we want to improve now if you want to improve somebody needs to monitor and measure to what extent you are improving what you will measure you will measure your processes so that means you need to make sure that somebody in the organization normally they are the process owners they are regularly evaluating how effective is my process this has to be a regular management activity every quarter every month every fortnight there has to be regular meetings with the management and process owners wherein they all identify and present about performance of the processes every process needs to have one two three four or more parameters using which their effectiveness would be evaluated very important if you take advice from our side with experience of more than 3000 clients in more than 50 countries try this identify processes try it for three months or a quarter you will feel yourself it has done a lot of good work for your organization because ultimately if each of the processes would improve the department will improve and when all the departments improve it is organization as a whole which will see benefits in terms of top line growth bottom line improvement and third and last very important part which we recommend all of our clients to give a lot of importance is internal audits what we ask our clients to do is develop a very strong team of internal auditors these internal auditors should be able to execute cross-functional audit audits at regular interval do not make internal audit just a paper exercise or, the, or a routine you need to make sure that you internal audit as stringently as comprehensively and with as much depth and object objective orientation as a certification auditor will do probably more stringent than the certification auditor because you do not want your good work to go and get derailed an audit will happen certification audit will happen once a year probably every six months but in between this time there are enough chances enough probabilities that people might go back to their earlier system there might be a lot of non-compliances people might get derailed to make sure that system is properly being continuously followed you need to make sure internal audit happens now if these three tools are implemented with lot of energy and dedication i am sure from our experience your organization will get based of the benefits of iso 9000 system in case you are looking at professional assistant the best consulting company to work with you to help you achieve your business goals and targets overall corporate uh, vision and mission contact us at 
iso-consultants.com or you can visit our website www.uaeiso.com we are here to help you realize your dream vision and mission thank you very much